let's understand about china rose as a natural indicator again china rose is derived from a flower I guess each one of you would be having a picture of this flower in your book because it's from there I think you will be able to get a better sense on the kind of flower it is okay so this is also one of the natural indicators that we have the color of china flower is light pink so you would have a light pink colored flower which is the china flower so the original color of china flower is light pink which is this color okay so this china flower or rather the solution of china flower can be taken from china rose so what you do is you take the petals of china rose from the flower plus add some water which should be warm into it and leave it for some time after some time what you will see is that the water which was there would change the color to light pink okay and you have the solution of china rose with you now this china rose depending on what you treat it with changes its color so there are two things that we have to test one is the acid and the other one is base so when you add an acid to china rose solution crs stands for china rose solutions so when you to add china rose solution to an acid the light pink color will turn to magenta which is dark pink you can use the word dark pink deep pink whatever you want to use whereas if you add a base to china rose this will turn green so this light pink color which was something like this out here will turn turn to green in case you add a base to the solution and dark pink i'm sorry i don't have the dark pink stuff in my color combination okay but it will turn dark pink when you add the acidic solution to this so maybe something like this okay so china rose is again used as an indicator just to resummarize the entire discussion that we had when you china ring rose is originally of the light pink color when you add an acid to it it turns dark pink or deep pink which is also known as magenta and when you add a base to it it turns green okay 